welcome to 330 to go. Don't change that dial. We're going to be live in just under three minutes. We've got a really fun show in store for you tonight. Folks, if you haven't done so, please make sure you enable 330 to go's morning minute on your Alexa app flash morning briefings. We provide daily content to give you information on what's going on here and there in the 330, as well as giving you regular daily specials for where to shop and where to get discounts at local restaurants. If you haven't done so, make sure you check out our website, 330to.go.com. You'll find all of our podcasts archived and all of our webcasts available on both YouTube and on Facebook. Please make sure you go to our page, 330to.go. Hit that like button. Make sure you follow us. We do offer regular specials and regular giveaways. We really love giving stuff away. If you haven't done so, please head over to our review page as well and let us know that you watch a show. Tell us what we do right and different areas where we might be able to improve. If you have an idea or a topic that you'd like us to cover, Please make sure you get a hold of us and we'll be happy to try and work it into our schedule. If you'd ever like to be in our viewing audience, we do have seating available for just about every show we do. So once again, please make sure you get a hold of us and we'd be happy for you to be our guest. Folks, we're almost there. It's almost time. Make sure that you're adjusted with your volume. Grab a drink and away we go. Take care, folks, and enjoy the show. Welcome back to Akron's hottest and fastest growing show, 330 to go. I'm your host, Hank Forrester, coming to you live from Stakeout Studios at Acme Number One. Tonight is our much anticipated Oreo taste testing show, and it's about to begin. But before we do that, we're joined by a special guest tonight, our host from Does It Suck? Let's have a big round of applause for Nick Mancuso. Thank you. How you doing, Hank? I, I always struggle with the button, Nick. I am, uh, I'm just living the dream. I'm just living the dream. <laughs> well, tonight's episode is brought to us by Acme Fresh Markets. As we mentioned previously, we are proud to be partnering with Acme. Just a reminder to use our promotional code when shopping online for your Acme groceries. Enter 330 to go as a promo code at orderacme.com and you will get a $3.30 off any order greater than $50. Groceries at the tip of your fingers. Yep. And just a note that the Alexa Morning Minute has been put on pause until January. Yeah, I mean, it, we our subscribers were down a bit, and I was putting out daily content, and I don't think peeps are ready for it yet mm -hmm. quite to use that platform. So we're going to kind of retool it. Uh, come up with some new ways to use it, and I'll come back at it again in January. So Yeah, it's a great tool, um, but I think uh, a little bit later. It's a little bit ahead of its time. I agree. But yeah. I, I like being on that cutting edge. So. And tonight is also brought to us by Missing Falls Brewery. 
Our anniversary show will be there next week to celebrate their soft opening and to discuss their upcoming grand opening. In addition, they have provided two different beer styles for us to use tonight for Oreo dipping, which is a new concept to me, but I am open to it. <laughs> uh, Brutus, which is a chocolate peanut butter stout, and Borgloon Belgian Ale, all on tap officially next week. So the neat thing is um, they haven't officially opened yet. So we're going to be joining them next week uh, for their uh, soft opening that we're going to do our one year anniversary show there on uh, next Wednesday, the night before Thanksgiving. And then their grand opening is next um, next Saturday. Dan Danny's looking at me like I didn't tell her that. I did not know. OK, that. well, you know it now. All right. So here, uh, the, sorry about that. Um, <laughs> Point being, uh, folks, tonight's episode is also brought to us by Sheena's Platinum Movements. I know Sheena's uh, tuning in. She's probably watching right now. Sheena's uh, Platinum Movements is located just around the corner, right around the corner here from Acme Number 1. She's just a kid from Akron, right? And grew up along with us. Uh, and students there range from ages 3 to adult. They cover disciplines of tap, modern ballet, hip-hop, jazz, and African style as well. They also offer private lessons. All right. So please find them on Facebook or online at PlatinumMovements.com as open registration is currently now available. Next page. Attention Acme shoppers, it's Hank from 3 Thrill to Go. Acme Fresh Market Pharmacists highly recommend that you get a flu shot this season. They're making it so easy for you. There's no prescription needed and most of them are covered by insurance plans. Uh, the best part is you get a $5 in free groceries just for getting your flu shot. Yes. I said five dollars. Hello. All right. Bazinga. So point being, um, yeah, I know. I still haven't done it yet. I'm gonna do it live on the air. I keep saying that, but I'm just trying to work up the courage. I'll be getting my flu shot live on the air. Go ahead, say something. You were gonna say something. Oh, go ahead, say it. I'll say be it. here for that. All right, <laughs> Danny, you're up. Danny's up. I just want to see you get the flu shot. Go. You're up. Please share, please share this right now. Hit your like button. Um, we need some reviews. Um, give us some feedback. Helps us know what we're doing right and um, continue to grow. We've also got a special announcement. A new show is onboarding now onto the 330 to go media network. Starting in January. Jan January. January. Bro. January. <laughs> January. Cool story, bro. Radio will go live with weekly special guests covering a wide variety of topics about society. So make sure you keep up in the future announcements regarding where and when to find them. And hey, I heard about your Christmas light contest. What's what's that all about? So we are in search of the best light display in this part of Ohio. Oh, that's awesome. So we're, we're figuring within an hour's drive, right? Because we, we could limit ourselves to the 330, but basically anybody within that circle, right. uh, we're looking for the Chevy Chase house that's here around the area, okay? Um, so the goal is to find the best light display. Uh, we've already had people submit, and which is a shame to me that they've already got <laughs> their Christmas lights up and running. <laughs> so, um, so there's that. Yeah, they, they uh, don't shy away from starting early, that's for sure. No, no. Um, someone, I saw a joke on Facebook that, uh, you know, uh, from Catholic faith, uh, you know, the Jesus being, uh, Mary being pregnant hasn't even been brought up yet. So, how, you know, they're not, they're already putting their lights out, right? right. Um, so, but ink, ink on that one. All right, so um, here we go, folks. It's Oreo time. Uh, so right now I want to introduce everybody to Nick Mancuso. He's our special uh, guest tonight, and uh, everybody, a big round of applause for him for being here. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. This is very, very exciting. So, Nick, tell us, uh, you got, you've got your own show, and it is part of our 330 network, and we, we introduced you a couple months ago, and you've been going strong and building that, that, uh, that following, and it's called Does It Suck? So go ahead and tell us all about it. It does. Um, the show <laughs> itself does not suck, though, so... Um, it's basically a review uh, page. It started with me doing movie reviews. Um, I've always done movie reviews on my personal Facebook page um, for a very long time, and I've always got really good feedback from my friends and uh, people at work, and my friends always have encouraged me to, you know, you should maybe start a page. You should maybe, like, pursue this a little bit more. And uh, so I did, and I've gotten really good feedback, and that's, you know, transitioned into me reviewing pretty much anything now. So it's a lot of fun, and I'm, I'm really glad to be a part of this network. 
Very cool. And you're also working uh, usually hand in hand close with uh, with Ryan, who runs 27 Squared, also part of the network. You guys did the uh, chicken uh, the chicken waffle. Uh, KFC review uh, yesterday. We did. We did that last so night. So if yesterday. you guys haven't seen that, make sure you tune in. You can find that on either the three throw to go page or my timeline or does it suck? Um, but that was really funny because me and uh, Kate had actually gone to eat that for lunch. So it was she. I ate it the she liked it. <laughs> <laughs> she she mixed it all up and ate it all together. So it was supposed to be a sandwich. That's what it was advertised, and I felt very. Was it, a waffle? it was just a big waffle and like three chicken tenders and I wanted a sandwich so I tried to make it a sandwich and it didn't work it didn't work all right so uh, here we go folks let's talk about Oreos so I'm going to rifle through this real quick because I got a bunch of people sitting behind me right now everybody yell say hey um <laughs> and they are they are wanting to try these Oreos okay so here we go the Oreo biscuit was first developed and produced by National Biscuit Company today also known as Nabisco and that started in 1912 in a Chelsea Manhattan factory which is in 9th Avenue uh, between 15th and 16th and it was first sold in New Jersey Okay. Uh, the name of the street that it was invented on is now called Oreo Way. The original design of the face of the Oreo featured a wreath around the edge of the cookie with the name Oreo across the front. In the United States, they were sold for 25 cents a pound. Wow. So you bought them by the pound, and they were in a uh, – this had to look really cool. They were in tins with a clear glass top. So kind of like a popcorn tin with like a glass top to yeah. it, and they were sold by the pound, 25 cents. I feel like they should bring that back as a marketing tool. That would be really cool, yeah. all right? Um, so the Oreo biscuit was then renamed to the Oreo sandwich in 1921, which then in 48 became the Oreo cream sandwich. In 74, fantastic year, uh, the, it became the Oreo chocolate sandwich cookie, and it didn't become the Oreo until the 80s, Okay. Uh, so the modern Oreo was developed by Nabisco by Sam Porcello, who retired from Nabisco in 1993. He had five patents directly related to his work on the Oreo. So back then there were only five flavors. Okay. So due to many different contests that Oreo has had over the years, there are now a bunch of different flavors. And now we are going to talk about those. Um, with part, partially hydro <laughs> hydrogenated vegetable oil, Oreo cookies are very popular because they meet a lot of dietary restrictions and they are considered to be vegan. So they are usually the vegan dessert of choice. Okay. However, there's still a risk of cross. What? Hold on. Uh, go ahead, Danny. Where did you find these facts? This is all from directly from Oreo's page. They're vegan? Yeah. yeah and they they're are. a good part of your diet? No, I did not say they were a good part of your diet. I no, said, you said that they were a good choice I for said, my okay, diet. I said, I said a, cho a diet. Did you read my shirt? <laughs> yes, I did. I said a dietary <laughs> choice. Yeah. Oreos are now a dietary choice. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I can, that's something that I can get behind. <laughs> all right. We <laughs> can stand behind this as a show. All right. So, point being... So at this time, at this time, we're gonna we got more guests coming in. Just fill fill on in, folks. There's more people. Give them a round of applause, all right? Okay. All right. So here's how this is gonna go, right? Um, right now, we're gonna have Danny kind of walk us through all the flavors. And as far as dunk options, folks, if you want to get a drink, now's the time to do it. You've got milk available. We've got water available. We've got the two different beers from um, Missing Falls a Brewery that will be on tap coming next week. <laughs> and in At the, that note, we should introduce him. In the back, back corner, in the back, back corner, we got a little secret shopper over there. Uh, live uh, right here with us is the guest host from the Hop and the Bean Let's have a big round of applause for Buzz Andrews. All right. Now, Buzz, Buzz brought his own. You want? Does Buzz want to talk real quick? And he could. Will the mic reach over there? Yeah. Okay. So, Buzz, go ahead and talk. Tell us what you brought with us. What you tonight, Buzz? What's going on? I brought um, <laughs> Artisan Ales Prairie Bomb. It's a double. It's they're called Double Dunk. It is a, they do this prairie brown with all different kinds of flavors. Um, usually it's vanilla, chocolate, and a little bit of pepper, and they deconstruct it as well, and then they have all singular origin flavors of those, all those flavors. But this one particularly is brewed with what other than Oreos, and I mean, you just smell it, and you can smell the Oreos. It's pretty amazing. And then I also have a, so it's an imperial stout brewed with uh, Oreos, and then I have platforms, Caramelicious milk stout, uh, brewed with Mally's chocolates and uh, salted caramel. 
So that's what I have over here. Very nice, very nice. Thank you, Buzz. So I'm not a beer drinker, but Oreo beer and Mally's chocolate beer may make it to my dietary. <laughs> It's healthy. Okay, we'll go with healthy. All right, so, um, so yeah. Just do it! Got it. All right, so, so right now, we're gonna, by the way, we got a great suggestion uh, from Michelle Pantia, uh, one of our loyal viewers. Uh, she suggested right now that we go ahead and we, um, she suggested right now that we go ahead and we would uh, save all the leftovers and send them into Miller South tomorrow. All right, so I think that's I think that's a great idea. They were the, she was the first to request it. All right, so here we go. Uh, right now, we are going to walk through all of our flavors. Uh, so, Danny, if you got the mic, go ahead and tell us what are we doing tonight. So we tonight have fourteen flavors to try, and then just the standard Oreo. We're going to try them one at a time, and then we're going to kind of vote on like. What were we going with if they met the requirement for what they say they are? Well, no. I, and if you could swallow it. Yeah. Because I, there was one think, that I couldn't. I think we're just going to go, because there's so many people and we're limited with time, we're just going to go good or bad. So you Perfect. either like it or you don't. And we're going to do yeah. it. We're going to do, do it. Thumbs, thumbs up, thumbs up, down. Thumb, just like gladiator style. So thumbs up, thumbs down. Okay. Everybody got that? Let's practice. Uh, do you like being on the show tonight? Any thumbs down? Any, any thumbs down? All right, so yay. All right. All right, here we go. So right, <laughs> right now, um, right now we're going to go ahead and get started. So we got some helpers. Uh, uh, Danny's got some helpers. So what is our first flavor right now? Well, first, do you, do, do we, does anybody have any like allergic reactions? Oh, no, that's right. Like I that? forgot. I forgot to do that. Yes, I'm allergic I don't want to be held responsible. All right, so everybody hold up your right hand, please. Everybody hold, hold up, up your right hand. hand. Everybody, everybody hold up your right hand. Okay, hold up your right hand. Repeat after me. I, state your name. I, state your name. That's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny. Bazinga. Right. Uh, I, I am aware that I am about to eat a lot of Oreos. I am aware that I'm about to eat a lot of Oreos. I claim to not have any allergies to the ingredients in these cookies. I claim to not have any allergies to any of these cookies. And I will not hold 3 3 to go. I will not hold 3-3-0 to go. Does it suck? Does it suck? Or any of the participants here responsible for my actions? <laughs> and I have a mumble, 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 mumble. Okay, we're off. All right, hook. let's get started. All right, good, good. All right, we're off. All, right, All right, we are going to start with, um, and I separated these into cakes. So first, we're going to start with red velvet. You're going to start there. So we got red velvet, okay. We have red velvet with cream cheese flavored cream. Did I get one? We gotta get them. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Don't forget us. All right. All right, so everybody gets a half. Okay, here we go. We're gonna try this. Uh, the drama. I got a drama button. That's the drama Always, button. Hey, make sure you smell it first. Oh, yes. Everybody smell it. Enjoy the Oreo. Smell it, then taste it. It's not. All right. It's not. It's not. We do not have wine tonight to dip Oreos. So this actual show got recommended. This is red velvet. During red. a... Yeah. Yeah. Is it... I haven't I tried know. it. It's not the best. I'm not, I'm not going to... I'm not going to give away my vote yet. We're going to have to distribute The cream faster. cheese inside is good. You need it. In fact, you can already start distributing the next one. All right. Sierra, you oh, can be, see, so you can be oh, able to help. You can still eat. Come and help. Come help. All Listen. right. The next one we're going to pass around. Wow. Could you give Kathy one? Okay. Kathy. All right. Oh, man. Those All right. Are so really... here we go. We're going to vote. We're going to vote. Here, look. We're going to vote. Right. You guys ready? Red velvet. Yay or nay? Thumbs three, up or thumbs three, down? Three, two, one. One, two. <laughs> you can't do a medium. Can't do a me in the middle. Can't do a medium. One, can't do in the middle. Three, Sierra, can you go to the board? Six. Seven, seven yays and one no. I get two no's. Oh, and I'm sorry, I'm a no too because that was gross. There's four no's then. Four, four no's. Four, four no's. no's. So seven in black. Uh, seven. Four in red. Off yes. we go. Next flavor. All Let's right. Let's go. We got to go Next fast flavor. now, guys. She All right. has her whole, the whole bag. Got to go faster. Okay. Give out Start two at a time. Go. Give out two at a time. Let's go. All right. All right. The we're next off one is Here Rocky Road Trip. Rocky, Rocky Road, Road trip. trip. Rocky Road Trip. 
Okay. Oh. Rocky Road Trip. There we go. Yes. You can start going around. Yeah, guys, you got to go faster, okay? I'm We're just, just trying to keep us on point. Hank. I'm trying to keep Slow us down. on point. Okay, good. And the next one's going to be birthday cake. So we got Rocky Road Trip and birthday cake. All right. I missed them. <laughs> That's Rocky Road. So it's called Rocky Road Trip? Rocky Road Trip. What's the trip? I don't know, man. <laughs> Rocky Road does not smell bad, at know. least. Bazinga. It doesn't have an odor at all, really. That's why it doesn't smell bad. I don't know. I've, I've had these before, and I, I have them reviewed on my page if you want to go see man. what I said about them. Man. No. I know, ma'am. Man. I know. I don't know who You're makes it. You're in the corner. I'm sorry. I, I don't want to. You're sorry, I don't want to give it. Man. No. I'll give it away. Give it all away. <laughs> All right, did everybody try that Rocky? Oh man, I can't right. even get it. Oh gosh, Rocky Road! You can't even finish it. I don't want that. The Rocky Road is too much. I chocolate, see Sean but... Hamilton uh, just joined. Sean, I'm gonna all right wash that down with some oh, Brutus man. right now. Oh man, that's horrible. Yeah, it's not good. All right, here we go. Voting. Here we go. Voting on Rocky Road Trip. You guys ready? Rocky Road Trip. Three. And tell the truth because that's bad. Three, two, one, and vote. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 12, 13 no's because it was gross. Rocky Road trip. Rocky Road did not have any fans. 13 no's. That's impressive. That was a full no. Okay, so now we got to keep going with the next one. All right, the next one is birthday cake. And the next one should be coming right out after it. Let's go, guys. No, no. Birthday cake. This smells like uh, icing. It does smell like, yeah, it does smell like icing. Thank you. Oh, God. All right, so, (laughs) so... Here, here, come on. Keep going. All right, birthday cake. Here we so go. So you're trying birthday cake right now. Birthday cake. It smells It smells like a birthday cake. I do have to give it that. Birthday cake. Yeah. That does not suck. It's straight icing. <laughs> it's straight yeah. icing. It's straight. Yeah. It's straight icing. The birthday cake ones are one of my favorites. Yeah, right. birthday cake's good. I could eat that. It's straight icing. It's All right. All right. Like All right, here we go. Birthday cake, let me see. All right. One, two. Birthday cake, three, two, one, vote. One, two, birthday cake. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight yeses. One, two, three, four, four, five, five no's. I give a yes. Okay. I already counted you. All right, here we go. All right, the next one that went out, I'm just going to give a public service announcement on it. No, All right. The next one is cherry. Don't say anything, at I, Danny. Danny. I will right. not say anything. Here we go. The next one, I believe. Is I may have cheated before the show and tried this one. Is this cherry cola? It's cherry cola. Cherry cola. Cherry cola. And, and should I give you a warning? No, no. At Danny. No, Danny. no. No, I'm reading the package. Okay, go ahead. It's cherry cola with popping candy. So remember those those like pop rocks that we used to have as a kid? It's got pop rocks. Yeah, it's got pop rocks it in it. It smells like a cherry Coke that you've left in your car and it's gone flat. <laughs> <laughs> it does. It's got a cherry Coke smell. I'll, I'll give you that. Okay, here we go. All right, go ahead. I've had these. I don't want to have them again. This is my favorite. Eat it. Okay. There you go. Here's the problem. Doing these early, this one, it's going to ruin the whole rest of the test. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. It's literally oh. one of the worst things. Man. You're going to need like a half a gallon of milk to wash that down. All right. And oh I can't my even gosh. drink milk, and I would. Oh, now they're popping. Now they're popping. You think that it's gone, and then all of a sudden it's oh, back. Oh, they're popping. <laughs> oh. It's like they're, the they're bad popping. ex-girlfriend of Oreos. Man. You think, yeah. you think they're gone, but no. Nope. Oh. Bazinga. Man. It's terrible. All right, let's vote. All right. Man, it's still popping. He called it the ex-girlfriend cookie that keeps coming <laughs> back. Here we go. Uh, we're all vote, right. Voting on cherry cola. cola. Three, two, one. One, two, three. Really? Did you dip it in beer? We got a full house. We got a full house. No. 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 <coughs> Buzz thinks they were good. Buzz liked it. Yeah, Buzz liked them. Oh man. You have to think though. He's drinking chocolate beer, so okay. he has a suede opinion. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. I think he said he's not suede yet. I believe the next one is strawberry. strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. Okay. We're in the cake oh. zone now, going into the pies. They're already passed out. I didn't get one of those. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, this one is strawberry good. shortcake. Here we go. That's not strawberry. It smells. No. Nope. It's got a. This has a good odor. It's got a good odor. I don't. I don't. I don't know. 
All right, strawberry shortcake. Everybody got it? What's everybody think? Scratch and sniff. Yep, it no. smells like a scratch and sniff. Does this I would have, agree. Does this have the Remember good, those markers? Good humor, <laughs> huh? good humor ice cream? Is that on the oh. package? Oh. Oh. I don't know. Does it taste just like that? It is. Oh, oh, good, good. You're right. Yeah. It's it what? Tastes just like it's that good. Thing. Wow. That so really I'm, soiled it for me. It soiled? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It was strawberry it's shortcake, so and then it became that. That's such an unpleasant word to use for an Oreo. <laughs> it did. It just really it used. It did. Do you have a button for that? It did. <laughs> yeah. Finish him. Oh, my gosh. All right. I, yeah. don't, I don't like that one either. It's like if you were to eat soap for a minute. <laughs> You know what I mean? What is, what is going on right now? I thought all these were going to be fantastic. Yeah, and this is a good one. All right. All right. The next one is peppermint. No. What? No, 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 no. The next one is chocolate peanut, chocolate peanut butter pie. All right. Well, let's vote on strawberry shortcake yeah. first. Okay. All right. Strawberry shortcake. Three. Or good humor ice cream. Strawberry shortcake. Three, two, one. Four, five, six, <laughs> four, five. It's funny. Everyone who likes the same thing and everyone who... <laughs> gives it thumbs down all does at the same time so people did like that okay that, 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 that was actually that got a favorable review yeah okay so all right. it's close okay so it's close kind of close, close on strawberry the next shortcake. one is going to be chocolate peanut butter pie all right chocolate peanut butter pie here we go oh have you tried this one no go okay. ahead and it's got a good odor did, did good, see the good, cookie good scent is like graham cracker almost <laughs> no that's good I'm not getting as ridiculous faces this time, at least. Hmm. Somebody's at the door. I think. I think that's a good combination. I think we. I think we got a winner there. Yeah. All right. Huh? Yeah, it's fine. Okay. I think we got a winner. Um, no, the next two are all good. So that was that was chocolate peanut butter. Chocolate peanut butter pie. All right, let's vote on chocolate peanut butter pie. Pie. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. You guys are hard to please. They haven't liked anything. It's a tough crowd. It's a tough crowd. Yeah. All right, so where are we? Um, Ten liked it? Four okay. don't, or three don't like right it. Right now, so far, that has been our most, uh, most popular flavor in terms of uh, people being happy. Yep. All right. So, all right, so chocolate peanut butter pie. That one was right bad. there, okay? Next is mint. Mint. Mint, just plain mint is the next one. Just plain old mint. Plain old mint. It smells good. I, it, smells, it smells really good. This is like in my top two favorite Oreos of all time. I know, I did that on purpose. It's like an Andy's mint. It's so good. All right, good. These, oh, these Andy dipped mints. in chocolate. And this is the... T oh. This is the time when the Andy mints are like everywhere. Yep. You eat like half. It's a very dangerous time. It is a very dangerous time of the year. That's good. But these are a good, healthy choice. Yes. Yeah, yeah. They're Just mint. Keep telling yourself and that. it's a dietary. Choice. That's good. That's good. And it's vegan. Just in case I wanted to be vegan, I can eat Oreos. <laughs> All right. Um, here we go. Uh, voting on mint. All right. Let's go mint. Three, two, one, and mint. Two, three. Really? Really, Buzz? No. Can we even? And then his, we it smelled like a thin mint, but it did not fill him, <laughs> satisfy him. <laughs> she just is so happy about eating cookies, she could care less. <laughs> All right, so we're good on mint. All right, what's next? All right, the next one is peppermint bark. Huh. Peppermint bark. Which are also amazing when you dip them in chocolate. This would be good to compare the mints. Mm -hmm. Peppermint bark. Okay. Are you drinking it with chocolate beer too? Mm hmm. Brutus. I, I think it's funny. He's next being taunted by Rocky Road Trip right here. I was just staring at him. He, in the did, face. he didn't even. He didn't even. He didn't even. Uh, he, he's like. He's like. He's just sitting there. <laughs> Look, he's like, oh man. All right, here we go. Rocky. Uh, what is this? This is peppermint, peppermint bark. bark. I got. It's not. It's good. It's very similar. I could eat that in my daily. <laughs> um, um, okay. I think it's good, but I prefer the mint. All right, peppermint bark. Here we go. Three, 
Two, one, and vote. This is peppermint bark. Peppermint bark. Yeah. Count you're them up. Not, you're hard to please. Count them up, count them up. The, the peppermint after the mint was a little much. Count them up. Yeah, it has like shards of candy cane in it. So. It does. It, it has crushed up candy cane. We have some new guests, so make we sure do. you get them the old Oreos, too. The other ones we are will. Well done. Okay. All right, uh, next, what we'll do we got? This is lemon. This is lemon. Is it lemon? Lemon? Yes. The next one is lemon. I think. Who was it that said, someone commented a week ago, just get a thing of lemon and just eat. Somebody it. commented, just was get lemon and was don't do. No, it wasn't Ryan. It was a, a lady. I it was forget. Somebody, just eat lemon and that's She it. said just to get lemon, and then we were also told to just get salted caramel. All right, so here we go. Um, uh, uh, Lynn, we got a comment from Lynn down in southern Ohio. Lynn says, I'm watching this, and it reminds me of those nasty-flavored holiday jelly beans. Oh! Oh, gosh. <laughs> Nabisco is not going to advertise <laughs> anytime soon We on will this not show. be getting a sponsor. <laughs> we are yeah, not going to get a sponsor we, we out of this show. For, depending on which Oreo it is. All right, what is it? Is this lemon? Here yeah, we go. Lemon. lemon. All right, love lemon. Uh. Okay, start passing these out. I need them to be in. Go ahead and yep. bless them there. <laughs> It's almost, it's almost too sweet. The lemon are a little overwhelming, I feel. It's almost too sweet. It's almost too sweet. Man. It's like a really dry lemon square. We can she continues to throw cookies at the camera. There's a pile of cookies right in front of the camera. Give us some! All right, so uh, we're going to vote on lemon. Here we go. All right, let's vote on lemon. Did everyone try lemon? All right, three... Two, one, and go. I'll give it a, I'll give it a yay, but it almost don't like it. It's too sweet. I'll, I'll say it's acceptable to eat. It's good, but, but it's almost too much. Six nose. I need you to put six nose. We're gonna have a snack. Right there. Jennifer's got it. Whoever Jennifer is, she's saying that. That's my girlfriend. Oh, okay. Well, she's saying that they're better and thin. Oh yeah, she does like those. All right. Yeah. But I don't, I don't. Sorry, right. Jen. Hi, Jen. So, <laughs> hello, Jen. Um, how, hi. How are you, Jen? Oh, my goodness. I've been really trying. Good to see you, Jen. She's like dancing to it. Good to see you. All right. So, all right. Uh, little Moving on, we are going to go right to. You know what? Speaking of, hold on. Let's do that. Let's do that. Before we go on to the next oh, one. Oh, yes. I don't have the board. All right. So, here we go. Live trivia. Live trivia. Uh <laughs> So, here's the deal. You can win in the audience, or you can win in the viewing audience. So Do you whoever, hear that? So we're going to ask a question, and who, you guys can answer it, or... Whoever gets the question right wins this Acme $5 gift card, okay? Whoever gets this question right for Acme gift card trivia, here we go. The question is... I don't have my sheet, but I think oh, I remember. I have it. Do you? What, what was the name of the horse that was closest to our broadcast table during the Forever Amber Acres broadcast? So the show last week. Our show last week, which was about veterans, uh, therapy options with horses. Who was uh, the Forever horse Amber that Acres, kept smiling? There was a horse that was right by and kept talking and smiling to us. If you can type it out or if you know here in the audience, what was the name of that horse? All right. So here we go. Uh, hey, there's, uh, say hi, everybody. Say wave at the camera. Charles LaBelle, owner of LaBelle's Barber Parlor, is on right now. He's I got watching. my haircut there Saturday. Look how good it looks. Yeah, yeah. So, 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 Nick, Nick, Nick's, Nick's rocking the LaBelle's, do I? You can always recognize the LaBelle's cut as soon as they walk in the door. They're, they're, love? they're very stylistic. Well, I'm not going to get, well, I'm going to grow my hair out, right? We're going to do the hair grow out thing. Could you imagine me with a LaBelle's cut, though? I just, oh. I can't do that. Oh, I'm yeah, not. You can't. I am. I am number two, and that's it. All right. So uh, Johnny, Johnny just uh, is guessing butternut uh, and butter stuff. That is not that correct. That is not correct on the horse. So it's not butternut. Okay. So butternut. At, yeah, butternut. No. <laughs> I think that's a flavor of Oreo. Then they said butter stuff, and then they said butter cup. All right. So the train. <laughs> he's just on the butter, butter, uh, butter train right there. Butter oh, is man. not in the name of just the horse at all. Do it. All right. So here we go. What's our next flavor? Here we our go. Our next flavor is waffles and syrup. I've been looking forward to this one. Me too. I've not had this one, so. I've been looking forward to this one. Okay. It smells really good. All right. Here we go. Waffles right. and syrup. 
It's the audience is not loving them. It's, it's horrible. I don't like it. I can't believe I like it. It tastes like waffles and syrup, though. But it's Stale not, waffles, but it's not good. with bad I syrup. I mean, I couldn't eat two of them. Is but... it possible it was on the shelf for a while or something? I mean, maybe. Ah, man, Ugh. I didn't get those ones. Wow. Did we order those in? No, I ordered that in. Oh yeah, I ordered that in. Just check that. We didn't check the expiration date on any of these, did we? Oh. <laughs> Whoopsie. No, no. It's, it, it tastes. It tastes like it's still fresh. They all made an oath, just, so it's okay. They can't. They can't hold us accountable. It just. It just doesn't <laughs> taste good. <laughs> all right, here we go. Let's vote on uh, all right. waffles. Waffles and syrup. And syrup. Three, what they've tasted better, warm. <laughs> Three, two, <laughs> one, and go. We have a couple two thumbs. Down. Really? I liked it. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. You liked Do it. you need to retaste it? He liked it. I didn't, I don't need to retaste that. I, I need to wash that down with right. Belgian. I'll take it. Woo. Okay, who has the thumbs up? All right, here we go. Next one. All right, the next one I we are down. going to do is salted caramel. I think. All right, so salted caramel is... They are the thins. They're thins, right? Yeah. Yes. All right, so here we go. They only come in thin, because I actually researched them. All right, so um, salted caramel thins. People love these. Well, okay, let's get some music. If they're thinner, are they better for you? Wow, it smells good. You just feel better after you eat forty of them. <laughs> you feel like you haven't eaten as many. Right. Because of them. I think they're the form of the diet cookie. I feel like I feel like Rizzo and Triv right now. Like we're just eating on the air the whole time. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like no, 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 no. What's up? Do you guys need a palate, a palate cleanser? cleanser? I just did. I used that some... Belgian. It's a beer from Missing Falls. It is. Uh, so my mom said the cookies are good while you're Bor eating them, but Borg they're nasty Loon. in between. Borgloon. All right, I'm 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 ready to vote on that one. You ready? Yeah. Do you need Do you need a palate cleaner? All right, here we go. Salted gross. caramel. Three, two, one. I'm curious. I'm not a fan of salted caramel either, but I really? like that. Really? You like say that. Addie is the only one that does not agree. You say no. caramel, I say caramel. Yeah. Do we have another That's one? That's why we okay. make a good team. Nice. Oh. All right. Here we Bazinga. go. Go ahead and bless them there. You need a thick. <laughs> she needs a thick. You need, <laughs> you need I just. Um, uh, I can't. I, I can't do that. What's the next one? <laughs> the next one is going to be. <laughs> Game over. Cinnamon buns. <laughs> All right, cinnamon bun. Cinnamon buns. I smelled this earlier and it almost made me gag. I'll tell you what, I could break these up and eat them in a bowl of cereal. I love these Seriously? Things. Yeah, man. Have you had them before? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. He's speaking of experience. Cinna cinnamon. It smells like cinnamon bun. Cinnamon bun. Have you had up. Oreo cereal? They, they Absolutely. Actually, they actually make Oreo cereal. All right. Um, here we go, cinnamon bun. Yeah. Wow. Can I have another one of those? <laughs> It tastes, it tastes so much better than what it smells. Yeah. Kate says they sound like when you, or smell like when you walk into the mall. That's, but Annie, that's the best. They don't smell <laughs> good, but they taste good. I think. Yep. I cool story, try. bro. All right. So here we go. We're going to vote on cinnamon bun. Ready? Two thumbs. Three, two, one. What do we got back there? What do we got? Woo! Everybody my dad. He All right. Them. So we're good on um, we're good on uh, cinnamon bun. Uh, Rocky Road Trip is still staring at Nick. It's sitting there. <laughs> so while there seems to be a delay in the cookies, why don't we go ahead and talk about this guy right here? Oh, All right, girls, come on. Circular uh, okay. came out this week. Um, Acme turkeys. You get one yet? Not yet, but I'm going to. Dude, we got a 17-pound turkey for like $11 or oh, so, wow. something ridiculous. How do you cook your turkey? Uh, I, I've always been... What? She what? said she'd cook it in the freezer. <laughs> I, I've always been... Um, I've always been um, the traditional oven on the roaster guy. Yeah. And I know and, uh, we have family that does it in one of those... You know, the, the deep oil fries? deep fryers. Yeah, we deep fry ours. Okay. It's, don't yeah. don't ever. All right, public service announcement from 3-3 to go. Don't ever put a frozen turkey into a deep fryer. 
okay? Why? If you don't trust me on that one, go look it up on YouTube, all right? <laughs> <laughs> Bad things <Really>? happen. <clears throat> Are you serious? No, no, no. Hey, That's... do you think that I cooked the turkey? Wow, Danny. Uh, okay, um, the more you know on that one. Oh. <laughs> The shrimp is also really well priced uh, for that, but um, you, you should tell Johnny that there's deals on butter in here. Yeah, He'll there's really deals like on. <laughs> He's all butter. I wouldn't get one free. Uh, Deidre's watching. Hey, Deidre, sorry we couldn't be there. <coughs> Deidre, we uh, we are saving a bag for you, and your friends are here, and your other kids t- test it right now. But we're sending a bag home for you, okay? Um, so back to the turkey. Yes. Uh, when you drop it in, if it's frozen, firefighters like show these videos it turns it into a bomb because the oil is hot at you know several hundred degrees and then, the and then you drop frozen anything you ever drop frozen french fries into a deep fryer yeah it goes <laughs> right this is true it's the same thing it literally turns the oil into an explosive and it blows the whole thing up and it's not good hence why i go to people's homes right to eat right so there's dinner. our public service announcement what your whose mom how did this turn into a Thanksgiving episode? We're eating Oreos right now. Everybody, I will be having Oreos for Thanksgiving. Everybody behind me wants to try, try a pistachio Oreo right now. I can just tell. All right, that is next. Are we on coconut? No, coconut's next. All right, is it a coconut These or thins? The co- both of the next two are thin <laughs> Oreos, and they're the last two that we're going to try, and then we're going to give you some normal Oreos. Okay. All right, so coconut. Oh, no, we have two surprises. Yes, we have two surprises. All right, so here. <laughs> All right, so here we go. It coconut. just got awkward. <laughs> Everybody tried coconut. Moving on. You said just guys, but awkward the whole time. All right, coconut. Put the coconut. We're running a Oreo. talk show, eating Oreos in front of Akron, Ohio right now. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Nick my does life. not mind. Nick does not mind at all. How are you doing on power on that? I forgot oh, to plug it in. Gross. Yes. I forgot to plug it in. We're good. This is not good. We're good. I just... Our, oh, okay. Coconut. All right, Coconut. <laughs> Kate, what do we think about coconut? No. You don't get a you don't get a maybe. That's back on. So how many people here have eaten tanning oil before? Like, well, is you this know a what I mean. Like when thing? you put it on and then you accidentally like lick your hand or something. The show just got know. really awkward now. All right, like, I'm an awkward person. <laughs> really awkward. Thank you Hold for on, having uh, me. Hold on. I I. <laughs> I'm gonna keep my other two questions to myself tried, at this point. I tried to deal with. I tried to <laughs> I deal with the technical. The... We're back on now, um, and and we've got a winner. We've got a Ooh, winner. Who is it? So here we go. She uh, went back and watched the show, didn't she? She must have gone back and watched the show. So here we go. We're, we're back on, and and the Oscar goes and to. And the Oscar goes to. Congratulations to Michelle Pantia. So Michelle uh, got so, the correct answer. Yes. The answer was princess. Princess is the answer. So congratulations, princess. Michelle. <laughs> Along with all the extra Oreos, we're, we're going to send you a Acme gift card uh, as well. All right, so so yay for uh, Michelle. Princess was a lot of fun. She kept smiling. All right, so what, what was our vote on coconut? Coconut. There was coconut. I was I was down on coconut. Oh, I'm down on coconut. Is it back on, honey? Yes. Thank you. Yes. They're okay. recounting. All right, I'm ba- I'm down on coconut. <laughs> all right, the next one. I cannot say. Yeah, all right. Say, it's say. Hold on, hold go on. Ahead. Go ahead, Olivia. Pistachio. Pistachio. <laughs> pistachio. That. All right. All right. Oh, my. So it's pistachio. Here we go. I can't wait to try this one. All right. Looks awesome. <laughs> Just. What? Just the Grinch? Did you see the Grinch ad with the pistachios? Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're also made with real cocoa. Did you know that all Oreos are made Bruh. with real cocoa? All right, here we go. That is so good. <laughs> Ma'am. I love pistachio, though. See, there's elements that I like, but I don't overall. Mm. It's making me... We have ah. people building um, towers out of Oreos. Oh. Yeah. Buzz is making us a masterpiece. Oh, man. Oh, ah, the aftertaste is worse. You like it? Uh, I do. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Some of these taste good when you're Ooh. eating them, and then afterwards you're like, what is in my mouth? Ah, yeah. Ah. All right. We are ready to vote. Okay. Who likes pistachio? All right, pistachio, here we go. <laughs> Three, two, one on pistachio. <laughs> no. I got a little pistachio lover and another pistachio. Another 
What do we got? <laughs> What we got? Wow, okay, so Pistachio lost. Okay. All right, so folks, here we go with our final two. Where is it? So we've got some secret Oreos we're bringing out right now. Nick is going to the bag. Here we go. We got two Oreos that have come from across the pond. We don't know how they got here. It took them almost two to three weeks to get here. All right. Damn, bless them, Nick. And they are not in, they are not written in English. Okay. So these are our specialty Oreos that we have acquired. Uh, let's see if we can get these closer to the camera. You'll notice that it says Oreo, but underneath, is that Japanese? Uh, Do we know Chinese or Japanese? That is yes. Japanese. <laughs> that, is, that is Japanese. All right, go ahead and show. I don't hold, know what it hold says. Hold those close. But... Olivia, go ahead and take these. Hold them close. Okay. All right, so we are going to be cutting these up. We're going to be cutting these up. We've got, we got two kinds here, and they are, Nick? They are uh, Buffalo Wild Wing. Okay, Buffalo and, Wild Wing. And Wasabi. Wasabi. All right, so right now we're going to go ahead and we're going to separate those. We've only got... I can break them into fours. You think? Yep. Raise your hand if you don't want to try them. Does anybody want to try them? You need to get off the court. All right. You need to get so right now they're going to crack those open. <laughs> and uh, no, no, go ahead and... Olivia, get off. No, take them, take them all and, and get on over there and do your thing. Okay. Um, in the meantime, um, we're going to just kind of hang out and wait patiently. Uh, we could talk about the upcoming schedule. Do you have any reviews that you've got planned for Does It Suck coming up? Um, I, I have a few movies coming yeah, in up. In fact, why don't you get, do, take a take an intermission, take the show over because I got to get that thing plugged in. Okay. And I'd like you to talk about number one. Uh, you know, I know you're big into Marvel comics. I know you're huge into Stanley. So yes. share share your thoughts on Marvel and Stanley and the direction they're going to go now, and okay. then talk about your movie reviews that are coming up. Absolutely. So, um, yeah, for those of you that don't know, uh, Stanley, one of the creators of a lot of the iconic Marvel comics recently passed away. Um, big loss for the, uh, for the nerd community, I guess you could say. Um, yeah, I, I was, I've never had a celebrity death affect me like that. Um, so it was, it, was pretty, it was a pretty hard day the other day. But as far as the, how the movies go, I think they have a pretty good grasp on the direction that Marvel Comics is gonna go with their movies. Um, I think that uh, Kevin Feige, the head of Marvel Comics, has a really good grasp on um, the direction and the, I the uh, ahead, ideas that Stan put into place for his comics and where he wants to go. And I believe that uh, he'll keep oh, true to, uh, to Stan and do him proud with uh, the movies going forward. As far as um, reviews that I have coming up, I am going to go see Creed 2 uh, as soon as that comes out. Um, you know, we're, we're getting into the holiday season, so a lot of movies will be coming out. Um, so I, I don't really know off, off the top of my head what all's coming out, but I, I practically do see every single movie that comes out. So if it's coming out soon, I'll see it. Um, Oscar season's coming coming around soon too, so a lot of big Oscar contender movies are going to be coming out. Um, on my page, I do do a Oscar review. Um, and tr if you can guess the, uh, I'm going to do a contest this year actually for the first time with a uh, Oscar ballot, and uh, I'm going to have a blank template. Uh, you can print out, uh, and then you can email it back to me, uh, and whoever gets the most closest, or whoever gets the most correct, or the closest to the most, I will have a prize of some kind I want to give out. I think that'll be a lot of fun, because um, the Oscar season is one of my favorite movie seasons. Um, yeah, so welcome back, Hank. <laughs> hey, that was good. That was good timing. Was good These timing. face expressions are awesome. All right, so have, have people tried them? Oh, my. oh, oh yeah. God. All right, so, so here, here. I am not trying them. Hold on. <laughs> we've got, we've got gagging. We've got spitting in the trash. We've got all kinds of Hold stuff on. going on back here. All right. All right, so, folks, here we are. We are live right now. Go ahead and share this. We are about to try <laughs> Buffalo Wild Wing Oreos and Wasabi Oreos. <clears throat> These have been special ordered. Uh, again, they've been... Brought over from across the pond. All right, here we go. 
Which one are you oh trying to Oh my god, your I'm gonna, son's like I'm gonna crying do, almost. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do the orange. I'm gonna do the orange. Oh no. That's a buffalo, buffalo wild wing? You smell it. Buffalo wild wing. Oh my god. <laughs> that is, 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 there is no redeeming quality to how that smells. It, no, you need a chaser. No. Make sure you're ready. Mm. You need a before and say, an after drink. I'm going to say, what does that smell like? You're, you're reverbing. Back up with the mic. I'm going to say, man, what does that smell like? Huh? Like rubber. Yeah, it does. Like a, like a bad, like where's Buzz? Like if somebody does a burnout. Like a bad, bad IPA. Like a bad rubber IPA, like a arrogant. No such thing. Stuff. He said no, no such, such thing. thing. Oh, I'll leave it to the beer guy. All right, here we go. You ready? I guess. Are we going in? <laughs> it can't be worse than the meat sticks. <laughs> oh my! You're right. <laughs> right. You are correct. All right, here we go. All right. Oh yes, it can. Oh yeah. my gosh. Oh my god. I hear it. I got out of my mouth. Olivia, please listen. Do it. <laughs> that was horrible. Oh! Get it down. Get it down. Oh, I'm... Oh, my gosh. I can smell it over here. Hold on. Oh, man. Hold on. I'm eating it. I'm eating it. We didn't, we didn't, we didn't agree to the fact that we, whether we had to eat them. Like, <laughs> eat it. Kate said whoever came over. up with that got fired. You get a little heat. It's heat. There's heat. Wow. Okay. All right. Um, oh, wow. Fatality. All right. <laughs> Let's. Is my mic off? No, we're still on. Go ahead. No, why just. Go ahead. All right, we're good. Go. Um, that was. I just never want to have to do that ever again. <laughs> Did it suck? That was horrible. I spilled water all over that, myself. What is my that, life? That was horrible. Oh, yes. that yes. was horrible. It sucks. It sucks. I only ate half. I was. I. I. I <coughs> hold on. <laughs> I need milk. You want water? No milk. I need oh. milk. Just a little thing of milk. Little thing of milk. That is horrible. That's one of the worst things I've ever had. <laughs> All right, folks. <laughs> that is horrible. Do you All right. think they taste? I'm gonna small. eat this rocky road to wash it down. Who ate the green right. one already? There. Who? Did are. anybody <laughs> like the buffalo wild wing one? Ah. Really? All right, let's vote on the Buffalo Wild Wing. We have We're one person. On orange. Three, two, one. One person would liked it. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. That was terrible, and you're right. There's like a little heat chaser like 10 seconds later. I'm so sorry I did that to you. <laughs> no, no, it was the right, it was the right call. 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 Okay. All right, so... We just get done with that, and now we're going back in. All right, so here we go with wasabi. All right. What? What? <laughs> to, uh, to quote Mater, uh, don't eat the pistachio ice cream. It has turd. All right. That's what that smells like. <laughs> All right, here we go. Smelling. I'm nervous. <sighs> I'm so, nervous, and I'm not even eating them. I, I, I can't. Okay. It doesn't have an odor. Nope. That's that's scary that's, to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! I wish we had a camera on her. Oh my God! Why does it taste like that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> it, it, I can't talk right now. <laughs> Oh my, for the first time ever, Hank cannot Bruh, talk. Hold on, I can try to eat it. Mm -hmm. Oh. He has milk. He needs some working. milk. I got milk. I got milk. I got milk. I got milk. I took too big a bite. <laughs> I wanted to eat the whole <laughs> I wanted to eat the whole half. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever be invited back. Oh. oh. Hey. How you doing? <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Quick commercial. Mm. Quick commercial. Oh. Okay. Are you, I, I feel heat on that one, too. A little bit. My eyes are watering. I think it's from the taste. All I, all I felt was despair. <laughs> oh. Okay. All right. Where's my clipboard? Oh. Who's got um, my clipboard? Over here. It's over there. 
Okay, let's vote. <laughs> All right, last one. Let's vote. Who liked the wasabi? <laughs> Three, two, one. Anybody? There's still some promising looks, now listen, but if, nobody if, liked it. Did, Tommy, Tommy, did you like it? Oh, you didn't like it? Okay. No one did. He said he was going to like it. Oh, man. I like wasabi, but I don't like that. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Exactly, but not on cookies. The problem is... And, and Do not call that a cookie. That's an insult. To our... It's vegan. To our it's studio, vegan. to our, I gotta get the words here. <laughs> to our, oh man, to our studio audience, I apologize if, um, if we caused you duress. <laughs> All right, so they took the oath at the beginning. They did take so, the oath. They did. We take did. An oath. Everybody right. took the oath. Let's pass out normal yeah. ones to regain our. All right, go ahead. Uh, give them everybody. Give them some normal cookies. Give them some normal Oreos, please. <laughs> Okay. Mm, those are terrible. Mm. But it'll help you clear your. <laughs> those, those are just terrible. 15 is zero. Okay. All right. Well, that, that pretty much is it, guys. So right now, uh, we're going to be passing out some, some normal. Oh, I don't want I don't want another cookie. I can't eat another cookie. I, here, I can't. Here. Here, give it to Kate. My tummy. <laughs> I've ruined you. <laughs> My tummy. My tummy right now Our is... Our first and last taste show. My tummy. Show. Oh, my tummy. <laughs> Angela Hardway has the quote of the night. The moral of the story is not everything should be a cookie. Yes. Agreed. Oh, yes. Angela, <laughs> Angela. All right. <laughs> Woo. All right, folks. Once again, guys, I want to thank you all for joining us here tonight. And a special thanks uh, to Nick. Uh, for helping out and for making sure uh, uh, to, to guide us through this process. Folks, once again, make sure that you go to his page, Does It Suck, and, and help him with his future reviews, and you can give him ideas and suggestions that you want, wants, that you want him to take a look at. Uh, usually, Nick responds uh, that day or two later, and usually he can do a review within a week uh, most times, except for when he's or, uh, ordering horrendous Oreos from across the pond. Yes. All right. So that's it, folks. Uh, once again, we've had a really good discussion here tonight. Uh, let me put this, get this ready to go. Um, next week, once again, we're going to hit the pause button. We're going to celebrate the anniversary of 330 to go. We're going to take a look back at where we've been, where we currently are, and where we plan to go. So we're going to be live from Missing Falls Brewery on the night of their soft opening, which means their taps will be open. Until then, I don't know where I'm going, but there ain't no sense in being late. Everybody behind me, say goodnight, Shirley. Goodnight, Shirley. This podcast is a copyright of Moon Garden Media Limited. Oh, this a lot of peanut butter.